Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to yet another edition of Rotaract's most influential and your host Rotaract of Suraj Vyas. Our guest of this time, ladies and gentlemen, is a person, you know, there are people who get into the bandwagon and follow the most convenient of routes, but there are some people who stand apart and take routes which are untaked. Guest has been the joint secretary, you know, of a club. From there, she leaped on to become a ZRR later on and then now she is coming back to the club as the president. Ladies and gentlemen, Dr. Shruti Sen. Thank you for such kind words. Yeah. So, how did you get into this moment exactly? 2008, during the PDR as Avi Kiran Ake's year. So, um, I was a little girl with wild dreams and, you know, creativity bubbling. And I was a part of RC Vade, if you guys don't know. I was a part of, I'm a product of RC Vade, which is no more into existence. Uh, Kelkar College which is Milan based so I was there and I wanted to bunk a lecture and I was looking for something and then this auditorium there was a session going on. So I happened to just enter the session uh, which was uh, taken by Ben Zerarar Rotractor Taruna Huja and my charter member also then Deputy DRR Rotractor Karan Raval. So there was this huge session on uh, road track and everything and then when you know they started uh, talking about road track and then red came, then there was a part for red. So this red, it, it just struck me that you know this is a platform which I need, you know to explore my creativity, to showcase my talent and to experience, to, to make mistakes and everything. And then suddenly as a, on the spot I enrolled, you know I gave my membership fees and then I became a road actor, so I got that RTI tag in front of my name and then there was 26 level there, so red got postponed and I apparently 26 for class, so I couldn't attend red, so that it was 26 level, so it got postponed and then we went to red, uh, I almost participated in every, every possible event, I got this uh, tag name as Chautada because I had this, this short hair and you know I was there in every spot. So that is how you know that it starts in my journey. Okay. Yes. You went on into Mumbai Mulan South. Yes. Yes. And then you became the joint secretary if I am not wrong. Yes. Yes. So tell us about that year as a joint secretary in Mumbai Mulan South, a community based club. How did you work over there? What were your experiences, the people you met, the bottom? So uh Rotractor Kapil Kulkarni, then the IPP, he, he dragged me in my, in his club and now my club, Rotractor Rota, Mumbai 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 Mumbai. So I was always good at writing, you know, I always used to write every single detail of the meetings and everything because I was fond of it and then I used to go back home and just take a run. And so then Jigal Kothari is a joint secretary. Uh, my year as a joint secretary was good. Uh, not I, I will I will say that not many itna bhi kaam nahi kiya but you know whatever wherever I could value I'd like writing the minutes of the meeting and everything and now when I look when I see I look back you know I have come a long way. Then she went on to become the PIR DCM with the PIR DCM yes. director. Yes. So tell us about that you you are working with you know different directors PIR directors of different clubs tell us about some of your favorites? So my first uh, year as a district council member, yes, huge. That feeling was really amazing. Uh, PI as director for Interact Relations. Uh, I had a team of, uh, we were a team of three people. Uh, road Raktar Nikita Aruja, she was Rotary Relations and Road Raktar Rishabh Ganeriwala, Alimina Relations. And we had this super cool vertical head, Road Raktar Sadia Joseph and Naseem Kanchwala. Uh, I have learned a lot, you know, I was a small girl with with lots of dreams but no vision or a channel. So these guys, you know, they were very experienced in road track and I was this little girl. My dream, my vision and everything got channeled. So I had this thing that, okay, I have to follow this, then I have to do this, then how to, I couldn't even draft a mail. So that first mail, we had, we had to send it to Savio, I remember. Mere bade bade points, like what is your vision to do for the entire year? Where do you see yourself at the end of the year? And my mails were, you know, huge mails. So then from there, then I couldn't even uh, use word documents. I am good at writing, but not 
she moved on to become the zrr of a zone okay leading a zone at this age so now at that particular at that time okay and now i am going to ask her about her experience as a zrr my by tenure as a zrr has been the best year in my road track journey my uh, i applied i never thought that i could become a zrr i always wanted to seeing at tarun by bhav gautam and everybody i wanted to but i never had that faith in me that yes i can lead a zone and that too zone to be the most diverse zone in district so if you know the geographical area is that there is a one club in mulund and three four clubs in bhadkopa then you know till khargar so it's really huge and very difficult to manage so i was given costa ghosh who is a gem of a person and you know we were announced we knew me but i was not aware who is costa ghosh so the baggage in it on the path and we you know together we achieved more and we knew that we have to make it big together that is the team um uh, from there zara ship i would say it was a roller coaster ride or you know ups and downs because my zone has always backed us up like very well it was like a it's like a fairy tale coming to an end a beautiful journey i have learned a lot you know then i i have i know that i can lead now i can take i have that faith in me the feel good factor that shruti yes you can do it because I, my people have given it to me so that is great so now i'm confident that as a president yes i can do it So this is somewhere she is backing up one thing that people might think after leading a complete zone, she is coming back and leading her own club now. There is some feel that it might be a step back, but it is not definitely. But I will ask her to you know just explain her vision in the next year about her club and what she feels about this particular leap from a zara to a president now. I I know what you just said. You know, people come to me and they tell me, "Are you going to zone lead? Can you lead fourteen clubs in a leading one club? Is like a chutki ka task, but it is not." So I have this broad perspective of leading fourteen clubs. I was leading fourteen presidents who are automatically leaders, and now I am one of them leading my club, being responsible for this entire club, which is very different from Zara Ship and President. And uh, taking presidentship, it was this thing that I have to come back to my club and give my club something back. My vision for the year will be: uh, I want to fulfill dream. I have a good majority. I have a good crowd, like members. I being a 16 year old girl when I joined Road Track, I joined in the age of 16. So I just think that I want to fulfill, fulfill my dreams in some or the other way, you know, doing creative stuff or whatever. And I did it. People made me achieve it. So now it is my task to make sure that my members' dreams are fulfilled in form of anything, just giving their dreams a reality. So you want to put over your members, the upcoming people, right? Yeah. Another thing is that once you have shared pets, okay. So how did you feel attending pets again this year? Both are different. That last year I was on that side. This year I was on this side. So last year, you know, being in the OC member, there is a different experience and learning. You know, you are sitting with trainers. You are having that thought process. You can connect to them, learning a lot and picking up things from trainers and chota chota things. And this year I was sitting here getting trained, so I cannot compare both the things that are. And comparison is is not my time. I I don't want to compare. But yeah, this side uh, sitting there, I have I have actually a lot of takeaways from pets. Oh, so talking about takeaways from pets, 
you have met a lot of fashion delegates you know the people you are going to be dealing with this year you met them i would like you to point out a few names like who you think are best including you or excluding me uh my batchmate like yeah right so everybody is good i won't be a diplomat but he yeah. are um i get you as my roommate first i like the fact that she's unafraid to ask questions she will go out she voice her opinion she is very firm and confident she does her homework well she is always there that you know i don't know this i don't know this she will agree that i don't know this i want to know she is always there for more of learning and everything uh second your president jazba batch she was in the very best but yes i go with her she was my best pr director so jazba and i share a very good relation and also i know that she is like his mother i know that she will nurture the club like a mother i want to mother as she feel me uh, but he yes, get she will nurture the club in a very beautiful manner okay so that was a very convincing answer you just explain your different designations that you have been through in rotra i would ask you which one has been your favorite goes without saying zara tenor uh, i am still a zara <laughs> so it it has been just like i said before you know it has been a fairy tale you know coming to an end with i won't say that i have been on a roller coaster ride because my goal was always there to back me with whatever no fall no ups and down nothing up yes a lot of up and it it feels really good to be a part of family going to be as because like a family uh having this it, i it is a part of me now i take the ownership of my own um chote chote members you know they coming to us and telling you know we want to be like you you aspire us to become a zrr it is it's lovely that you know you can you have that little impact you can do you can do wonders It has been a great journey, which is coming to end. But it's okay. Yeah. All good things must come to yeah. end. So now, uh, tell us about the connection of your connection with RCN. How is your connection with RCN? Uh, starting from Shay, uh, you know, he was my batchmate, district council member. To Kilan, my co-CP pet, we have gelled a lot. Me and Kilan were like best of friends. Are still we are not in touch that much, but yes. Ah, uh, then uh, Jazba Bach, my my PI director and the best one. Ah, uh, she 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 always used to make sure that she updates me about every single project. If I don't touch you, be nice. Yeah, touch me, John. I I'm sorry I couldn't attend the project, but she still invite for every single project. So you know I have Ben Hardik Nagar. Ah, uh, you the Jared Pets also. There are many many I. Craig Miranda, I know, and not some connection between. So I want to ask you about this thing that social media is the new thing in the road. That the advent of social media obviously is there everywhere. Social media right now. What do you think? What is the scope of social media in the road? So social media is like Somras. If you guys have followed Shiva Trilogy, I will you know say that it's like Somras. You know, if consumed in a good way, it can. It is pure and it it has a lot of advantages. But if not, then it can be evil. Uh, so also, you know, there is a limit of form. Don't abuse social media. Uh, after the subke, you know, we publicize our project through press tag, mails, and Facebook teasers and everything, which is like a rage, which is very good. So you know, reaching to the mass via Facebook is the best option. Free publicity. As you call it, uh, two projects I like to name. One is uh, Road Track to Network. You know, this talk show is RRS. So yeah, this is like an amazing, you know, good good utilization of uh, social media. Second, uh, we connect. Uh, it's a project from uh, RT by RTBS. So uh, it's uh, uh, they, you know, the way they utilize the resources, the social media, Twitter, in a way. Which is very good, remarkable. Uh, uh, now, since you are the influential guest of ours, I would like you to give an influential message to our upcoming members and the viewers. The final word for me. Being a cartoonist and really connected to Batman, Iron Man, and Superman, I would like to quote Batman. Allow me. Uh, if 
It's not who you are underneath, it's what you do, do defines you. Oh. So that was something that covered it all. In short, I hope there are many Batman fans over there that can connect with your statement. So guys, that's all for this time. And I would request you all to subscribe to our link over here. That will be given in the description. And thank you, stay loose.